Warren's. Yeah, I feel like White and Warren has the best cashmere. Honestly, you know who else does cashmere really well too? Naked. Oh, naked pills really naked fast. Sucks. Yeah, naked pills really fast. No, I think Autumn Cashmere does a really good job. Good morning, you guys. Happy Friday. I just said to Tasha, I'm going right now to go get a coffee with Kate. I'm gonna update you guys once I get back, but I told her I would be downstairs in a minute, so I need to go. Hey guys, I thought it'd be kind of fun to do a quick little OOTD. We're going to get pasta. Um, so, starting from the top, I'm wearing a little Rag and Bone sweater, um, Jill Sander coat. Um, I still don't know how to pronounce this. Regina Pio, P-Y-O bag. I really wanted the Roe banana bag, but I couldn't get my paws on the chocolate version. So I got this instead. Um, Kate jeans and then Chanel flats. Good morning, you guys. I haven't vlogged since I showed you my outfit last night. But last night, Blake and I went to Um, We like went to the olive oil store to pick up some more olive oil. but it's chilly and I'm actually having this back pain, you guys. It's like right, it's actually like near my shoulder and it's so bad, it like goes to my neck and I'm kind of a little bit miserable because of it. Like, I just don't feel my best, um, but we're still gonna get out and go to the farmer's market. It's been, this is like the second day that I've had it really bad, so. Yesterday when I went for a walk, it really helped because I think it just helped like, I think gravity helps push inflammation down, but I don't know. I need to like get it figured out because it's really painful. Um, and it's making it so that like, I don't want to live my everyday life, which freaking sucks, but that's okay. I'm gonna actually do some stretching right now. Um, just to like hopefully move it around and like soften the fascia in my body. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna do that and then we're gonna go. Blake's showering now, he just worked out. I slept in. And yeah, I'll show you guys my outfit when we're getting ready to go. Hi guys, just got home from the farmers. Hold on. Let's chat while I wash. Um, I got broccoli, mushrooms, cauliflower, and then I got these chocolate peppers, which look so good. She told me they're like sweet, like a red pepper, um, but she said they're really crunchy and yummy, so I'm excited for those. I ended up just putting stuff away because honestly, I was just like, and I was on the phone with Natalie, um, my friend Nat, you guys know that. And I just like didn't really want to deal with like leaving all the stuff out because it's kind of nice like if you're on the phone to just put stuff away while I'm talking. So farmer's market was good, it was freezing. Um but yeah, now we're home, obviously. I have some packages that I need to open. I don't know what they are. I think they're from Grimm's. Cause I literally, like, that wouldn't be. I have no idea. But anyways, um, the farmer's market was really good, though. And I might be meeting a friend later. I'm unsure. Um, but it's actually one of my friends from high school. I'm just waiting to hear back from her. Also random, you guys, but I'm pickling mushrooms. So, yeah. Like, do you remember what else was in them besides vinegar? 
mean, they put onion in them. I'm just gonna do vinegar in this, though. I'm not gonna do garlic. I was just gonna do vinegar and then maybe some sugar. And salt, you have to do salt too. Mm -hmm. Do we have plain sugar though? I, I mean, it doesn't really matter the sugar, does it? Well, like, what do you mean? Should I do like honey is what you're saying? That's weird though for mushrooms. Like if it was onions, I would do honey, but mushrooms, I feel like I just need plain sugar. Do you have coconut sugar? No, I don't think so. I know I have brown sugar, but that's gross too. Is it? Okay. Yeah, I don't know. This has been my current juice combo as of lately. Lemon, um, cucumber, celery, and then a uh, knob of ginger. Hello, you guys. I spent the whole day, well, we went to the farmer's market and then I met up with my friend Claire from high school and her friend Lexi. And we went to Foxtrot and just got like, they got coffees, I got a tea. And just hung out. Um, but they were going to like an early dinner vibe at Duck Duck Goat. And I honestly was like gonna go with them. And then I was like, cause they were like, do you wanna come? And I was like, mm. I'm not gonna like do that to Blake. Cause I feel like Blake would be like, what, you're leaving me for dinner? <laughs> So I was like, no, it's fine. But anyways, now Blake's not here, weenie. Um, that's okay. I'm gonna go out on a walk, um, cause that's what we do. So I'm just wearing cozy little uggy things, cozy cashmere's, this Jerf Avenue top, which you all need to invest in. It's the Jerf Avenue Oxford, and it's literally the best. And then big coat and bag because I'm going to stop at Whole Foods so I want to be able to put stuff in a bag. But I think I'm going to bug um, my friend Grayson. You guys know Grayson. I'm going to bug Gray. See what she's up to. Bye. I'm roasting cabbage. Be generous with your seasonings, people. This is your sign. Blake got a sous vide and this new personality trait. Good morning guys. Happy Sunday. Um, I'm alive, alert, awake, enthusiastic. And um, that's definitely a summer camp song. But I slept like a baby last night. And I just did my meditation. And I've been doing these card readings from the Animal Spirit deck that I've been showing you guys. I'm like obsessed with them. They've been so spot on for me. And I have gone back to the Journey in the Heart book, which that book is so good. I, it's honestly one of my favorite like morning, like whatever you want to call it, devotional books. Um, it's so well done. So if you're looking for something to like start a morning routine, I really recommend that book. It's great. But it is currently nine and I'm meeting Kate in 30 minutes. So I need to get my workout on. Um, I'm gonna do, uh, actually, I don't even know if I'm gonna work out. I might just do a little stretch for that guy, but I'll do like a little stretch, whatever, and flow maybe. I could do that, like a Tasha. And then we might go to a ritual later. I don't know if it's gonna be a um, flow or if it's gonna be yin or what, but Yin means like you're holding postures for a while. The flow is obviously like more of like a sweat-a-thon. But last night was so good. Blake got his sous vide. I'm not kidding you. It's his new personality trait. And like he's literally obsessed with it. If you don't know, sous vide is a way to like slow cook meats. And you basically buy this thing and then it like circulates around water. And last night he sous vide pork chops. You know what? I'm not a pork chop girl. Like I didn't grow up eating pork, like besides bacon. So I just feel like if I didn't grow up eating it, I don't really like it. Um, and I actually really liked it. So he did a good job with that. Um, but he was like so excited about that. And Joseph's in Iowa City, Joseph's Steakhouse, a place we love to go, has a dish that has pork, 
really good cabbage and then um, potatoes. And so I was like, cool, I'm gonna kind of like recreate that. It sounds like kind of a weird combo, but I'm gonna do it. So I made roasted cabbage, pork, a salad, potatoes. And I also did broccoli because I wasn't really eating pork. So I was like, I need a little bit more than some cabbage. <laughs> um, it was really good. It was a good meal. Um, and today I just wanna relax. Like. I need to do my newsletter. This is like the first day that I haven't done my newsletter till Sunday because usually I get it out Sunday morning, but I just haven't had time to complete it. So I need to do my newsletter. I need to, I want to edit this vlog and probably get it uploaded on a fun little Sunday vlog action. Um, and I want to read my book. I'm reading a Christmas book, you guys, and it makes me ready for the holidays. Blake and I were just talking about when we're gonna set up our trees. There's gonna be two people, or two types of people that are listening to this. Like, one type of people is gonna be like, set it up now, the other type of people is gonna be like, wait till after Thanksgiving. I'm not waiting till after Thanksgiving. I'll probably set it up after Halloween. Like, maybe like November 1st. Anywhere from November 1st to November 10th. I don't know when yet. But my grandma's birthday is November 11th, so we're going back to Iowa City for that. Um, and I want the tree up before. Okay, I'm gonna do my workout and then go see Kate because I literally only have 30 minutes to do whatever I'm gonna do. So I will see you guys in a little bit. Changed my plan, decided to go to Ritual, so I'm just wearing a little Ritzia bodysuit and coat and little shoes, but 10, class starts in 10 minutes, so I gotta go, bye. Fresh and clean. Literally, I'm so clean right now and it feels so good. And I just made a juice. I went to yoga and then Kate and I went for a nice long walk. Literally the best way to start a Sunday. But I'm gonna enjoy my juice. I need to clean up this mess that we've got going from my juicer. Um, and then I think we're just gonna kinda chill today. I need to do my newsletter and edit this vlog. But other than that, like, I don't know. I don't really have anything like crazy that I wanna do. Um, but I think I'm gonna end this vlog with another favorites again, and Blake's gonna say his favorites too. And I'm just gonna do the two or the three favorites that I have for my newsletter. So I'm gonna clean this up and then we'll do it. Hi guys. So to end the vlog, I'm gonna tell you my faves that are on my newsletter because I know some of you guys don't subscribe, which you should. Um, you can subscribe at my website, but the first one is these slip on booties. Why is this not letting me click the link? Maybe it's because this is the, I have like the draft, but it's the booties from Amazon, the alpaca ones. These are the best. I'm not even kidding you, I'm obsessed with them. I got mine for $20, but now they're already 60 because Amazon does dynamic pricing. But yeah, these are also, LOL, I was gonna do some online shopping at Whole Foods a couple weeks ago and I never did it. So I need to just like get all of these off. But these are the best little booties ever i'm not kidding they're so comfy and perfect you should buy them i think they're better than uggs because they're like the ugg tasman or tasman whatever that have like the um threading here but they don't have the threading so that's way cuter okay so that's my first fave this specific brandy tea guys screenshot this is my second fave and i wear this tea all the time i'm literally wearing it right now this is it specific the Haley top it's so perfect the neckline is perfect it hits at this perfect length it's so good $18 seriously go get it while you can next is just cashmere you guys know I love cashmere and the final one is licorice she which I've talked about in my vlog but I've never talked about in the newsletter so I added it um but yeah if you want to see more then sign up for my newsletter it's literally the best okay I'm gonna end the vlog but I love you guys um, and I'm going to start a new vlog in a little bit. So I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.